<laughs> oh my god. Okay guys, um, let's hold over here. So, as an engineer, um, you are basically a very shit rifleman. You don't really have anything for you, except you have a mine, C4, and you have sandbags and barbed wire. Sandbags and barbed wire are really useful because in essence they take ammunition instead of construction, so it's quite like cheap actually for you to build. Um, but what I'm mainly going to discussing about is the C4 and the mine. Um, so C4 is a very powerful tool. It can be used to um, put a um, radio into 75% health, which is just going? out of leading out. Um, so that started. means that in essence, I if you put one C4 on a radio and you dig it down with like two shovels, um, it's going to be dead within a second. So that's something to really keep in mind. And uh, against non-armored vehicles, it can basically blow it up in once. And um, armored vehicles, it can fully destroy the tracks. So um, I'm going to show you. So it literally works by just putting it down on the like area you want to. Don't put it down yet. Don't put it down. And then it has a 30 second fuse. Um, to it, it doesn't really have that long of a range. It has a um, 10 meters firing distance. So, like, if you're within 10 meters of this, um, or like outside of 10 meters of this area, you should be fine. The Dude, moment boys, you start, right. um, so what you want to do is you want to hide your mine. So, um, once you put your mine down, uh, go ahead and refill. Yes, in the move. Quick thing is you can actually put down 10 mines in an entire match. So that's quite interesting. So everybody just put down one mine, yeah. Try and dig it down, get a feeling of it. Absolutely fantastic boys, that was really good. You guys, the most the important is, yeah. thing about mines is yeah, again, you, you know, if someone if someone is right. like running I'm over this or like seeing this, they're instantly yeah, gonna spot yeah. all these mines. So what you want to do is you want to hide your mine. Really easily done is by finding a rock that is a quite decent Why size, like off? this rock. And you put the rock uh, you put the mine underneath the rock. So if you check this so you see this mine now, right? Stop stop digging down the mine for a second, please. Bots, can you please at least pay attention? Okay, so you see this mine, right? So it is under a rock, so a really cheesy tactic now is if you dig this mine down, it's vanished. And literally, the enemy will never be able to see this mine. In general, don't forget as well, right? This is a proximity mine. It doesn't care if the vehicle is friendly or enemy. So if you like a friendly vehicle drives over it, it's dead as well. So be careful with that. So basically we'll go like one shoots, then the second, then the third one. There is one important rule to understand when you're shooting mortars, which is called the 20-20-20 rule. What that means is when you shoot a mortar, it takes 20 seconds before the mortar lands. When the mortar lands, it does an area of effect damage of 20 meters. And then the other 20 I forgot. So if you shoot, it deals an area of effect damage of 20 meters, and if you shoot rapidly, so that's why, for example, you don't want to shoot your mortar, like, click, 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 as soon as it's reloaded. You want to wait a little bit, because otherwise it switches, like, 20 meters, 20 meters, 20 meters. So instead of firing on the target, you just shot, like, 60 meters behind the target. Firing, so go ahead. Firing. Good hits. Firing. Let's go too far again, I think. Firing. Okay, hold firing for Hang a second. On. Just reload all your cannons. Okay. Or like all your um, mortars. Yes. Make far. sure that there are three rounds. Yeah, but in essence, those were some pretty good shots. Not gonna lie, guys. Um, mortars are always gonna be a little bit inaccurate. It's kinda like the 2020 rule kinda means that it's like 20 meters chance. So, but in general, uh, pretty good. I blast. Cut. Good hit. Awesome. Woo! Good shit, dude. That's the that track. Was Good stuff. Yeah. First. Now you've taken the track down, knowing that the T62 is listening to an angle on the right.
So we need to aim quite a bit higher if we want to hit that ammo rack. All so right. if you look, yeah, look at the tank with binoculars if you want. And see, right, it's listing to the right. And I want to be able to hit the ammo rack. Um, oh, put, your cro know. put your crosshairs on the the break in the metal when it curves down on the front plate because the the tandem is going to arc is going to be low so if you aim if you can right. aim for your tandem rocket to hit the top track that should be an ammo rack clear that last uh Woo! Ammo, boom. ammo rack see nice good shit you hit the ammo rack it's important that you do do the drills Otherwise, you could have just harmed somebody for no reason. Yep. I don't know why it didn't kill me then. I was right behind you. Oh, it's a bug. Right, it won't do it. It's right behind you. Good hit. Starts. You know, see that? That was out. a little bit, little bit high. Okay. Like that would have gone, I would say, through tr through the track and maybe hit the upper plate. All right, back with clear. Clear. Ooh, and boom. That's nice. the ammo rack. Good shit. And you know that the end law is a bit a bit difficult in the sense that it always likes to be low. So you're gonna to need to aim a little bit higher if you want to hit where you want to hit. And put your uh, personally I would say aim for just above uh where the beginning of the armored track section begins. Because it's gonna, because your projectile is gonna be angling down. If you hit too far down, it's gonna be angling into the dirt. All right. Clear back blast. Fire. See, that was too low. So like this. So I'm gonna go panning, and I'm gonna go like this. There's enemy here. Bang, bang, bang. Yeah. I'm set. Right on your six, moving up. I'm gonna pan these boxes. One down. Quit. I don't know if there's an enemy there or not because I can't see. Uh oh I thought you I thought you were it's like then. Alright, I'll pan this one. If you can see, shoot him, because I couldn't. Pan him. One enemy down. Uh, enemy behind these two boxes. Uh, I'm out. But he's down. Moving. Enemy in the window. He's down. Another one. He's down. 